After 111 days of hell, they all deserve a break. We all do. Today's facts are more good news, and I don't even need a PowerPoint to explain them. The hospitalization number is 1,284, the lowest number we have seen. We conducted 79,000 tests yesterday, which is a record high for us. And we have the lowest weekly infection rate, less than 1%. And we have the lowest weekly average of lives lost, 25 souls each day, and we'll remember them in our thoughts and prayers. All regions of the state have lower infection rates, and the state experts have gone over all the data, and they will allow New York City to begin phase two on Monday. But COVID isn't over. We still have much more to do. We have to monitor the local infection rate. Local governments must ensure compliance and do tracing. We have to watch out for a second wave. We have to watch out for possible infections coming now from other states and many people need help to get their lives back to normal. But with all of that, it's clear that over the past three months, we have done the impossible. In the beginning, this virus hit us hard because it actually came from Europe after we were told that it was coming from China. When this started, we had more cases per capita than any state in the country or any nation on the globe. But today, we have done a full 180 from worst to first. We are controlling the virus better than any state in the country and any nation on the globe. And it inspires me and energizes me and excites me. If we could accomplish together what we did here, this impossible task of beating back this deadly virus, then there is nothing that we can't do. And we will be better and we will be stronger for what we have gone through. And it shows us how capable we are when we are at our best. It shows us that we have great potential to do even more, and we will. Now New York must lead the nation on police reform and lead the way on building back better. We must lead the way on re-energizing our economy and protecting our environment, and then welcoming a new era of civil rights and social justice. I know that we can. We learned that our better angels are stronger than our demons. And sometimes we just need to listen for them. Over the past 111 days, we heard them. And it was beautiful. Let's keep listening together. Thank you for everything, and God bless.